Actors learn to develop a thick skin to shield against the disappointment of not getting roles they auditioned for. And that was true for Isabel Sanford as well. When she finally got cast on All in the Family, she was hired for just one episode as Lionel's aunt to establish the Jefferson family's move into the Bunker's neighborhood. Well, much to her surprise, she was later called back for another bigger role. She explained that in our 1991 interview. And in fact, later, when the producers decided it was time for George and Louise to move on up to their own series, she didn't want to go. But first things first. They liked what I did. <laughs> so tremendous <laughs> that they, they called me back. And they had, because I said to John Rich, I said, but I was supposed to be the aunt. He says, who's going to read that? <laughs> you went to do the audition for All in the Family, and like all actors, I assume you perfected the art of doing the audition and then forgetting about it. I mean, so you know, you don't think about. Oh, yeah, well, I, I, I the... train myself. When I go on auditions, mm -hmm. when I leave, uh, I try to throw it out of my head. You know, we hate disappointments, and that's what this business is all about. But then they called me. And then sometimes it's like winning the lottery when you get it. Oh, yes, yes. I was so glad. I didn't want to leave All in the Family to go into Jefferson, you know, because it was a hit. Yeah. The, all in the Family. And you didn't know what I didn't Jefferson's know what the Jefferson's <laughs> put it to. I didn't want to go. But once, though, that uh, Jane, called me. She said, I understand you don't want to go leave with the Jeffersons. I said, I don't. She said, why not? I said, because I like working and on the family. She For said, sure, well, you John. know, she said, well, you know, when we start, we are getting someone to play Louise Jefferson and we're writing out Louise <laughs> Jefferson and on the family. Well, then, of course, that helped me make up make my up mind. Make up your mind. <laughs> and the rest is television history. Isabel Sanford died in 2004 leaving behind a pioneering legacy and an impact on American pop culture. She made her motion picture debut in 1967 as Tilly the Housekeeper in Stanley Kramer's now classic Guess Who's Coming to Dinner, starring Katharine Hepburn, Spencer Tracy, and Sidney Poitier. While it was Spencer Tracy's last film, it marked the beginning of a remarkable career for a remarkable woman who, against all odds, prove that with enough belief in yourself, your talent, and your ability to make it, miracles can happen. By the way, Isabel mentioned the names of two other Hollywood legends, names you might not know, but people who made a significant contribution to the Jeffersons, and in fact to many of the comedy series from producer Norman Lear. Jane Murray and John Rich. Jane Murray was the casting director who found and cast the actors for Lear's shows and John Rich was the Emmy Award-winning director of All in the Family, The Jeffersons, and countless other comedy series we now consider classic. And by the way, if you're ever in Hollywood, be sure to stop by and see Isabel's star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. It endures, along with the Jeffersons' reruns, as a lasting tribute to her popularity and her contributions to entertainment. And if you're a fan of the Jeffersons, then for sure you won't want to miss our interview clips with Isabel's co-star, Sherman Hemsley, who portrayed the irascible George Jefferson. But while you know Sherman as an actor, I'll bet you didn't know that as a kid, he wanted to be a singer. Junior high school was when I became into the singing thing, you know, mm -hmm. harmonize with the group, make the girls swoon and stuff, you know. So that was what I wanted to do. I wanted to be a part of either quartet mm -hmm. or quintet. Was I there was a certain tenor. something you would do to make the girls swoon? Like just the way you Yeah, you know. No, 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 go ahead, teach me. You're driving me crazy. <laughs> <laughs> and it gets better. <laughs> Check out our interview with Sherman Hemsley. It's not to be missed, right here on rerunit.com. From Los Angeles, I'm Brad Lamack. Thanks for watching. <laughs>